Hello everybody, my name is Pizza to Brennan, and welcome back to a very, very, very hyped up episode of Crazy Craft. For those that have been excited about this, this is a very exciting episode. For those that haven't been excited about this, this is the last episode of it you'll see for a while. So, kind of it's a win-win situation. But today, what we're going to be doing is we are going to be tackling the final two Iron Man Mark suits. If you guys haven't seen, we still have our portals down here. It's actually really freaking cool. If you guys haven't seen, we got our Stark Mark Hall over here. We still need to find Mark 1. <laughs> I still need to remake Mark 1 because I think Choco actually took it. But we got all the marks of Iron Man up to Mark 20. Apparently the mod is updated to 30, but it's not updated on the server yet. So when that comes around, we'll tackle them. But for right now, we're good. But anyways, we have all the way up to Mark suit number 18. You guys saw, actually, this guy crushes people. So we still need 19 and 20. Now, I haven't actually taken a look at what the uh, requirements are to make suit 19. I just knew off hand that it's actually um what the requirements are for 20 so we're gonna go ahead and just hop straight into this and just get started with it so mark 19 is this guy over here he kind of looks like captain america without the blue code name is tiger he's got a little star mask there mark xix the 19 helmet high velocity suit he is going to require mark 10 to complete which requires the iron man helmet shell okay so let's go ahead and get this started then i don't believe we have any shells around here no we do not okay let's go ahead and take all the stuff from here then now what are we going to need to make Mark 10 then? So we need the shell for that. We need another vibranium arc reactor. So we're going to need, um, I think, just one of these. We can grab a few of them then. Uh, some titanium ingots over here to make those. More Stark text right there. We got a full stack, actually. And then uh, we're going to need our repulsors. Now, we do actually need a few more repulsors. I can just go ahead and grab those off right now. We might as well. Uh, you guys actually mentioned to me that you are loving the addition of this table here. Uh, and you also said one thing to me, too, um, that if... Oh, wow. That actually literally drained everything. You guys had mentioned to me that if for whatever reason I have vibranium... Like, let me go ahead and just do this real fast here. Let me go ahead and throw this on the ground for the time being. I can actually just use this portal here. If we used more uh, of these than we needed to, like we have all these vibranium cores, I completely forgot that I can just literally go back here and just pop these guys back in the table to get more energy. In fact, these vibranium cores, I think, actually have more energy than god apples overall, which is actually pretty sick. So now we've got all the fuel that we need. Thank you guys, I know. I derped. I just I didn't think about it. You know what I mean? So anyways, we got all the repulses we need. Let's go ahead and just get this guy crafted up. Uh, we'll just take four repulses for right now to work with. Okay. I am so excited. It's going to be so weird not doing this anymore, man. We need to get the... We, okay. Black iron blocks already do have that. I did set that up. We're actually running very low on black iron blocks too. Let's go ahead and see what we need for this. So Mark 10 is going to require uh, glass panes. Four of these around here, and then a Stark Tech at the top, I believe, and that should do it. Yep, we got Mark 10. The chest plate is going to require the Vibranium Arc Reactor, which is, of course, going to take... Oh, we need, actually, the Arc Reactor around there. Vibranium Core. Perfect. So we can go ahead and grab this guy over here. Now, for some reason, my sound is a little borked up on Minecraft. You won't be able to hear me walking, unfortunately. I have... Oh, wait. Oh, I forgot it works on here. For some reason, on my regular client, you can't, even though I have that turned on. Anyway, so Vibranium Core around here. Stark Tech on the corners. I believe it's like this. Please tell me I'm correct. Please tell me I'm correct. Nah, of course, I'm wrong. It's I'm wrong every time about that, man. All right, then we got to do around there. So we got the Vibranium Arc Reactor. We got the chest plate. What else do we need here? We need the two repulsors. They can go in the bottom here. This is a very easy one to make, you know what I mean? Those there, and then these on the side. And there we go. We got Mark 10. Uh, what do we need for the leggings? The leggings, I guess it's just like, this is easy game. I actually didn't remember that the leggings require repulsors too, though. Oh, fascinating. Okay, so the leggings are done. We are going to need more repulsors for the boots then. Yes, we are. Okay. Yeah, this is a very easy suit to actually craft. And then, of course, for Mark uh, 20, I believe we have to craft... Um, Wait, what did I just do with them? Oh, I put them up here. I believe we have to craft Mark uh, 7 to work with that one. So we can put the boots here, three of those on top, two of these on the side, and we've already got Mark 10. Now it's time to do Mark 19. See what we need from this bad guy. So Mark 19, Tiger Suit. First one we're going to need is a titanium plate, three of those, white stained glass paint, which we've already got, and uh, I don't know if we'll need vibranium for this. Okay, I think we're good now. So let's go ahead and put in Mark 10 on here, the titanium plate at the top, and then, what was it? Two of these white ones here, three Iron Man armor plates, and two Stark Tech on the side, and there we go. We got our Mark 19 high-velocity Tiger suit. The chest plate's going to require... Ooh, very fair amount of repulsors. Uh, what is that? Four repulsors. Oh, wrong portal. And... Eh, oh. <laughs> I love hitting my head on that and just thinking I'm going to die just by uh, force of habit. Repulsors, let's get a few of these. All right, that should be good, hopefully. 
Hopefully that'll be enough, and if not, we can just go back for more. Okay, so this guy's going to require repulsors here, and then two on the side. There we go. So then we got the vib- Oh, we're going to need the vibranium arc reactor. How could I be so foolish? We need another one of these. We haven't actually needed to use these, though. Which is weird how it goes from, like, needing the, um, whatever that weird block was that we needed from, um, uh, Stan Lee. Now we need the vibranium cores back again, which is a little bit odd, but okay, I'll, I'll deal with it. Now, let's go ahead and just make two of them while we can right now. So we'll grab these around here, and then I believe I'm already going to forget. Was it like this? I, I'm pretty sure it was like this. Am I wrong? Okay, I'm correct. Thank God we got it right this time, okay? So we can go ahead and put that away there. There we go. And let's go ahead and make the chest plate now. So repulsors on the side. There we go. And repulsors here. This vibranium arc reactor in the middle. Mark 10 on the bottom. And then I believe it was two Iron Man armor plates. And there we go. We got Mark 19 chest plate. The leggings are going to require not really all that much either. Mark 10 right there. And then I believe two Sartek and two of these... No, reverse them, and there we go. We got Mark 19. Really not taking a lot to craft this guy. And then for the boots, we need more repulsors, obviously. We actually only have one repulsor on us. How awkward. Okay, let's grab that from there. And this guy's also pretty interesting. What do you need from me? Two titanium plates, and then... This is a very strange one. And then two of the repulsors on the bottom. But nonetheless, we've got the full Mark 19 suit. We can go ahead and pop this bad boy on. And what do we look like? We look pretty damn nifty, I would say. Really, this is a very, it's a very interesting color scheme. I mean, you can't really take it seriously, considering I have this, like, weird uh, colored backpack that just disappeared because I forgot to duplicate it. So that's our backpack there. Uh, we look a little bit strange with our cheese head on, but I mean, hey, Packers represent, even if they're struggling a little bit. I don't know how the outcome is this game going to go. They're up 16-6 in the halftime, but <laughs> we can only count our blessings. I don't hold much for them right now. They need to prove me back. So anyways, we got Mark 19. Let's go ahead and just put this thing up on the suit, and then we'll get ready for Mark 20 to complete this. One. Here we go. One, two, three, and four. That guy's looking pretty nifty. I think that's pretty cool. Okay, so then we got Mark 19 around here. We'll do tech scale four, bold. Oh, wait. Whoops. This is the wrong one here. Tech scale back up to one. Was it right here? Yeah, this is the right tech scale. Tech scale four, perfect, and then we'll bold it up, command L, and then mark X, I, X. Perfect, baby. Now when you use that double X, let's go ahead and do it right now. I'm too anxious for it. Okay, let's put on our stealth suit back again so we can actually craft these guys. Uh, there we go. And let's see what we need for Mark 20. So he's going to look like Python. I thought it looked like a tiger there for a second. So he is codenamed Python, the long distance suit. Curious as to why it says long distance. We'll look up exactly what the um, like benefits of it are in just a moment here. Let's go and see what we need for this guy. So we are going to need Mark 7 to tackle him. So we'll go ahead and first get the shells out then. Do we have enough um, or do we have more Iron Man R shells? We don't. Okay, so let's go ahead. Whoop. Wrong one again. I keep forgetting not to go in that portal. It's my force of habit. All right, let's go over here and grab out a few more uh, shell. Oh, did we not learn these? Oh, no, we did. Uh, no, it's plate. I forgot. It's not the shell. Uh, Iron Man armor plate. There we go. So we can just go ahead and do that. This is going to drain us quite a bit. Yeah, drain us about 8 million to finish up that stack right there. But it's worth it. All right, let's go around here. Stack up the titanium plates and more of them there. All right. So we got the chest plate running around there. We got the leggings done. We got this and we got those. All right, we're looking good. Now, for Mark 7, what do we need to craft you? So for the helmet, we're going to need... Do we need vibranium arc reactors? We do. Okay. So for... Let's go ahead and get the... Actually, no. I like doing the helmet like one at a time from the top down. So we need two titanium plates on the side, two glass, three Stark Tech, and then the helmet right here. All right, very easy. Mark 7 done. Chest plate's going to require, of course, a vibranium arc reactor. So we'll go ahead and grab... I think we'll need maybe two more of these as well. Oh, no, we already have one. Forgot. Okay, so we can just go ahead and pick that up for right now. Uh, what else do we need for this guy? We need two repulsors. Do we have more repulsors? Did I grab enough? Uh, yes, we most definitely do. We can go and keep four on us there. Okay, so the repulsors are going to go, obviously, in the corner, as always. Plenty mark reactor in the middle. Iron Man chest plate shell at the bottom. And then we're going to need two Stark Tech at the top. The uh, Stark Tech plate frames. And Stark Tech actual things there. There we go. We got Mark 7 looking great. And the leggings are going to require two more titanium plates, which we can craft just on um, here. Oh, I don't have a backpack on. Shoot, forgot about that. Okay, let's go ahead and make more titanium plates. There we go. We got nine. All right, so we can put these on the side. Stark Tech in the corners. One, two, three, four. And then the leggings done right there in the middle. Mark 7 is complete. And then for the boots, well, it's not complete, actually. Titanium plates along here. Two of these down there. Repulsors on here. And then go ahead and swap that out for that. And we now have a full Mark 7 suit. Looking pretty... Let's actually put it on right now. What does Mark 7 look like in comparison? Yeah, he looks like... He just looks like Iron Man. He looks like Iron Man for sure. But I'm really excited for what we're about to put on soon. All right. Mark... 20 the final mark let's see what we need for you so we're gonna need 
Black iron and gold plates. Fascinating. Let's go ahead and put away the limonite block, vibranium, bronze block for right now. Iron plates, we, I assume we won't need. So we're going to need black iron plates. These don't have an exchange energy. We already have a ton of black iron blocks, though. So we can actually make this into a ton of black iron plates. Here we go. Do that. And then we'll do the same thing around here with the 64. And perfect. We got 24 of those bad boys. And we're also going to need gold plates, which I believe we've got a good amount of gold in here, which we can take and make into plates. Here we go. Set that up there. That is more than a stack. All right. That should be enough gold plates. Hopefully, we're good with that. Okay. So, see what we can do from here. So, the helmet is going to require uh, two white stained glass pane along the side right here. We got the actual helmet in the middle. Gold plate at the bottom. We need the... What was it? Black iron plate, I believe, like this. And then the Stark Tech on the side. And there we go. Our first piece of the final suit, Mark 20. The chest plate's going to require... Not too much, actually. Just another Vibranium Mark Reactor. We can get that set up right now. Mark Tech along the side. Uh, is it Mark Tech? It's Mark Tech. No, St Mark Tech. Stark Tech. Did I really just call it Mark Tech? Holy crap. Here, we're going to need more of those good old Repulsor things that we need to go ahead and grab from here, I believe. Uh, repulsors. We just need, like, an infinite amount of these guys, really. It's the only thing we really need to come back for. All right, Repulsors down on the side here. Chest plate's going to require uh, two gold plates along here, two black iron plates at the top, chest plate on the bottom, and then the arc reactor in the middle. There, This guy's actually not all that difficult to craft. Okay. The leggings are going to require Mark 7. Okay. Really? Actually, this is a lot more anticlimactic than I expected. It's really not taking a lot to craft this guy. Uh, do we need to swap these here? Yep, there we go. And we are one thing away in before the boots are like craft all of them. Nope. All right. So we need to craft more titanium plates. We'll do that real fast. Of course, we need to go ahead and pull away from the Stark table one more final time. Here we go. One on. One, two, three, four. Black iron plates, I believe, were on the side. And then this in the middle and Stark Tech on top. No, I tried guessing. It's gold, right? No, it's black iron. No, I actually got this completely wrong. Okay, now we need to do it like this. And then a... What was it on top? It was a... No, oh, wait. No, hold on. Black iron plate at the top. I completely butchered that. And repulsor at the bottom. And guys... There you have it. The final mark, mark 20 completed. Let's go ahead and set ourselves up, see how we look. One, two, three, four, and we are now Python. We're Python. We are Python, the long distance mark suit, the final mark suit of this like current section right here. Apparently, it's up to 30. We'll get that updated later, but I'm going to go ahead and look up real fast here. Where is the... Let me just go ahead and do that real fast here. You know, it's actually really freaking funny. So, they have a Wikipedia, right? For You can look at, you know, the superhero mod. They got all the stuff on there. And every single time, even yesterday, when I was recording this, Mark 20 was the final suit. We now have confirmation. Based on this, there is 30 marks. And I can look at them, but I don't want to. We're pro I'm probably going to ask the guys to update the mods soon. Because that's just freaking awesome. So let's go ahead and see what Mark 20... Because I would assume, you know, this guy isn't the top tier. Let's see. So what do we got from here? We have Speed 4, Strength 10, Acrobatics 2, Fire Resistance, Night Vision, Ultra Advanced Flying Systems. Can travel longer distance. So that's Ultra Advanced. So we have... I guess that's why it says Long Distance. Because it's Ultra Advanced. Literally the longest flying suit of of the mark, I would assume. Uh, and then from here, we have hovering, faster refuel system, the predecessor. So it's the fastest refuel system in the game. Um, then we have gliding, vibranium powered repulsor, vibranium powered unibeam. Oh, wait a minute. Does this guy not have what Mark 18 have? Oh, you know what? Hold on a second. I want to test. I'm not going to test it over here. We're going to test it like a little bit of a ways away. Let's test it like right here. Hold on. I don't think he has. Hold on. Oh, so Mark 20 actually doesn't have the large, the ultra-powered unibeams. Oh, very fascinating. Because if you guys saw from last episode, this is the damage that Mark 18 did on that identical thing. Like, watch. It's nothing in comparison. In fact, that actually drained really freaking quick. But, uh, what is it? The refuel system holds suitability too. Let's see, how fast is the refuel on the 60? 70. Okay, that's decently fast. All right, that's, that's not bad. 80, 90, and then 100. Okay, we go up from there. We got the shoulder mounted guns, of course. Uh, shoots them, which is this, I believe. Yeah, there we go. Shoot six at a time. We can rapid fire. A little bit more than six, but all right, that's fine. Uh, rockets, suitability four. Same thing as before. We got flares, suitability three. You can fly those off into the sky. 
and we have the laser anti-cloak Jarvis mod and no fall damage. So I guess the main perk about this guy is the fact that he can travel farther. We don't have a force field like with 18. We don't have the larger powder unibeams like 18. In all honesty, I think I actually prefer 18 more, but maybe that's because I haven't tried flying with this guy all that much. But I mean, I do have the cloud pet, so maybe that's why I don't really even care. I mean, we can fly without this suit on, you know what I mean? We can take the suit off and we don't have flight, but we can still fly because we have the cloud pet. Still though, all right, let's go ahead and do it. The final thing. Now, obviously, here's the little thing that we need to make an addition to. When we get back into doing this, we're obviously going to need to extend the Stark Mark Hall. This is what I want you guys to do in the comment section down below. Leave me an opinion. Let me go ahead and just go over this so you guys actually know what the hell I'm talking about. Right now, currently, we have yet to do anything uh, past this wall here. We've yet to do anything like that. But, so we can still expand it even further down. But it's a question, you guys can let me know. Do you want me to extend the actual room physically longer down? Or, do you want me to go the route of doing an underground passageway? Because that's what I originally anticipated, was that they were going to put in all the marks. And I didn't know when it was going to be, but I would want to build more rooms. So I would just do like a little stairwell down and there would be more of these guys. You know, just, just to make it so we didn't really need to expand all that much. So I think that's what I might do, but you guys can leave me your opinions down in the comments below. I'll probably go with that. But anyways, here we go. One, two, three... And and for the final suit, let's name him and just keep it official. Can we do tech scale 5 to make it official? I believe we can. Here we go. Mark XX. Perfect. That right, it's a little bit cut off, but you know what? Fudge it. I don't care. We have the final mark. I actually wanted to change this a little bit here. I want to actually move the uh, Mark 8 suit name up one higher to right about there. Tech scale 3 just to make it a little bit neater. So we do uh, from here, Mark X. What is it? Uh, this is 18 XVIII. There we go. That looks a little better. It's just a little higher. So anyways, that is the final. Well, it's not final now. Ah, oh, freaking man. I thought I would have it complete, but unfortunately, well, fortunately, they have more suits up to 30. But I mean, that's still pretty freaking awesome. Uh, obviously, as you guys can see, if we search on Mark 21. Our mod's not updated yet, so we still need to. And obviously, we need to get our own little place because like we need to definitely hang up the stealth leggings into an area. We need to hang up. Uh, what is it we've got in here? We have... What did I do with it? All right, we have uh, iron bat boots, so we definitely need to hang that up too. I don't know if we'll make a bat cave eventually. I think we might have to. Uh, I definitely want to try getting into more hero mods, but as well, I know, you know, I look around. A lot of people, pretty much the majority of the people that are remaining on the server right now are doing superheroes. I'd like to do a little bit of some other stuff on the side, maybe get into witchery uh, just for a little while until we get the mod updated and then finally get to, uh, you know what I'm saying, Mark 30, and then maybe by the time we're done with that, they'll have Mark 40. I don't know, but anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed Enjoyed. It's a rather short episode just to kind of get to the point finish up the marks guys The Stark Mark Harl for right now is complete until we get renovations. This is oh, no, no mark one Oh, no, I forgot mark one. We need to make mark one. I'm so sorry. Oh, no, wait, where's mark one? Oh, no, we need leather <laughs> Oh, dude, I completely forgot. I was like it's complete. It's not complete. It's not complete. We need the rest of the marks. Where's leather? Hold on, we need to go back out of the... We need to get the table. We need to get some leather from here. Where's the leather? Come on. Oh, man, I feel so bad. Here we go. Let's just get a full stack of leather. Oh, dude, I was just about to say it was complete. Thank God I caught that before I got, like, a bunch of comments. Pete, you forgot about... I forgot about your friend, man. Come on, you can't do that to us like that. In fact, there's, there's probably already comments assuming that I forgot about it. I'm sorry. If you commented it, deleted. I'm sorry. Okay, so Mark 1, we can't really do it too evenly here because we can't just search up Mark 1. Uh, so Mark 1, chest plate's going to require a mini arc reactor. Oh, God. I forgot about crafting these things. High-tech electronics and a palladium core. Do we even have palladium cores? Oh, no. Do we, we better have a palladium core. Oh, thank God. I was going to say, if we don't have any palladium, I'm probably in a rage. All right, Hero Maker, I think we have to craft this in. Yes, we do. All right, and high-tech electronics along here. We got those, and we got these. Dude, I almost freaking forgot, man. Like, what the heck? Do we need to, uh, I don't think we need to do that in the other table. I think it's just like this. Is it just like that we craft it? Yeah, okay, perfect. So the chest plate again is going to require, where is it? Mark one, four iron blocks, two electronics, a leather tunic, and that. This feels so old school, man. Like, it feels almost noobish. Like, it does feel noobish, you know what I mean? All right, we got iron blocks. Let's go ahead and craft this guy out. One, two, three, four. This is before we needed to build repulsors, man. All right, and then we got the leather chest plate here and the electronics on the side. We got Mark... This is such like a throwback. We're crafting Mark 1 after we craft it. It's almost romantic, you know what I mean? Mark 1 helmet we already have there. Uh, where are the leggings? The leggings are right here. So for this, we need magnesium. Oh, 
do we have magnesium i know we do yeah we got two of them right here and then i believe more iron blocks i love this we have to use iron blocks again man all right one two and then the leggings in the middle and i believe it's just like that yep there we go and the final for the boots where i'm trying to watch the football game while i'm recording here we go and we need two rockets that's funny oh and oh man i thought you got a touchdown <laughs> So you guys watching this probably already know what the outcome is. Don't tell me, okay? Don't tell me. All right, so here we go. Put down the rockets here. Uh, well, actually, one, two, like that. And the rest of the boots, what did they? What else did they need? I think it was, was it iron blocks? Where's the boots? The boots were right here. Okay, the boots. Okay, yeah, so it was the leather right here and the two iron blocks on the side. And now we can finally say, wait for it. Let's hop back through here and shebang shebang and shebang now we're done with all the marks we got all the marks done up on here did not leave behind our trusty faithful mark one anyways guys that's gonna go ahead and do it hopefully you enjoyed be sure to let me know your thoughts on the room be sure to let me know what else you guys want to see take care and i don't normally do this but just to say as like a little bit of progress drop a like on the video if you guys are just excited that we finally got through all 20 marks but anyways take care guys and enough rambling get you back next episode ciao